Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be doing a PR unboxing of mail that I've gotten over the past month or so. There's food in here, there's hair, makeup, skincare, a little bit of everything. So if you enjoy this type of video, be sure to subscribe, but let's go ahead and get started. So full transparency, I'm incredibly depressed. I'm having a really hard time right now. I'm really struggling. Um, so the packages have been piling up dealing with a lot of grief. Last month I lost my mom and my cat in the span of like four days. Um, and I'm still having a really hard time, but uh, I'm also having like a hard time lying around and doing nothing, but then I'm also having a hard time working. So it's this very weird in between. So either way, I thought we would just open up these packages together. I have sort of opened up some of them to some degree, like over the past couple of weeks, kind of seeing what was in here, things like that. Uh, but firstly, I have the Olaplex Bond Maintenance Conditioner and Shampoo, and then I also have the actual Olaplex as well. I don't think I've ever used this shampoo and conditioner. Also, if my hair is looking mighty fine, it's because I just went to a Chatters event with Curlsmith, and I think they did a really great job on my hair. Very rarely do I ever leave an event and actually like my hair, so. <laughs> This is actually an order that I got from YesStyle. I don't think I've ever ordered from them before, or maybe I've ordered from them once, but I'm actually gonna do a full little haul on that, so stay tuned. I got some sheet masks, a little bit of makeup. And then, I know this is the new Makeup Forever Concealer. I'm so excited. The Makeup Forever Matte Velvet is one of my favorite concealers of all time. The HD Skin, we'll see how I feel about it. These shades look pretty light. Um, 3-1-N, 3-4-N. I also bought the new Makeup by Mario concealer, so stay tuned for that. You can see that's the 3-4, that's 3-1. I wear 4-2 in the other one, but we'll see. I'm gonna put everything in a box, so I'm gonna open up this big box here. This, I actually also know what's in here. It came while I was home in Newfoundland. And I think this is really so cool, although like, in some ways it kind of breaks my heart. <laughs> um, but it's from, oh my God, I don't wanna cry. It's from Fancy Feast. And, um, oh my God. Rue did try these before she passed away and she liked them. Um, but I thought this was such a cute idea. It's the power of the purr. So they sent along this like music. I don't know if it's actually for cats or not, but Catastrophe, Purdy Pictures, Flamin' Cat. Um, and then these are the Fancy Feast Savory Cravings Break Apart Treats. Oops, looks like a chocolate bar. Um, and then, because what I really liked actually that they did was they were like, hey, we want to send you a um, record player. Do you already have one? to like avoid waste. So I thought that this was so beautiful. I actually do not have a record player. So that's so cool. And then let's see if Bambies is into this. Bambostino! I honestly feel like I haven't even been able to deal with the loss of Rue yet. It's still really um, surreal. Mmm! This is a Fancy Feast Savory Cravings Break Up Our Treat in Tuna Flavor. Oh, Emily doesn't like everything either, so. Cat's purrs are proven to help lo lower stress, blood pressure, all of that. That's cool. And what was making me sad, besides the fact that this is for cats, is I got one of these in PR a long time ago, and Rue and Emily loved sharing this little box to sleep in, so it's just like, oh, breaking my heart. Anywho, something else that I got is from Coco Kind. I've actually never tried their stuff before, so I'm excited to try. I've heard good things about their skincare. I'm not sure where it's available. I think Shoppers Drug Mart as of recently. This is the Resurrection Polypeptide Cream Ceramide Barrier Serum. My skin's been pretty unhappy lately. And the AHA Jelly Cleanser. So I'll be trying that. Okay, and this, I gotta get this out of my way. So um, I just got home actually from this hair appointment and I had a big PR package and it was like leaking. I was like, what's going on? Anyways, there was a bit of an oopsie, I guess, in the delivery communications, but because I'm a food, 
food girl now. I got this Hamilton Beach Cool Touch deep fryer. I've never had a deep fryer before. You know I'm an air fryer girl. So I'll be putting this to the test uh, and Mazzola, but they sent along chicken as well. They didn't tell my building there was chicken in the box. <laughs> it's rank. So I'll use my own chicken wings. <laughs> but I'm very curious to try that. It's cool touch. It looks very compact. So we'll see. You've got a little bit of everything in here, I told you. Then from Grown Alchemist, I really like their skincare. This is the Natural Hydrating Sunscreen SPF 30. What I'm curious about though is will this give a white cast? What's this? Is this a little tote bag? Ooh, it is a tote. I kind of like that. Chrome is in. Then in here we have. Oh, from Urban Decay, I love, okay, I love all the all-nighters, but I really do like this vitamin C one, and I also like the um, all-nighter ultra glow. Mm. You can't resist a mini. And then this is the Hydromaniac Blush Glow Highlighter, and it's in the shade Rebellious. Looks like a lot of blush, honestly. And I've been trying to buy, like, berry blushes lately because all I buy is peach, so that's what that looks like. It's pretty. I don't want to put it on my face, but I literally can't see myself in the viewfinder, barely. Grief is one hell of a beast. And I went home to Newfoundland to help take care of my mom because she was really sick, knowing full well what might happen. And it all just happened so quickly. And then I didn't make it home to see Rue. And it's just, I'm just in disbelief, honestly, of all of it. Um... <clears throat> Okay, this I'm so excited about. You know how much I love this serum. This is one of like the really high-end products that I'm like, it's good, spend the money. If you can, I mean in this economy. But this is uh, a long comb serum. They're HCF serums. It's got hyaluronic acid, vitamin C, and ferulic acid in it, I think. It's got these three little, just brightens your skin, makes it immediately look nicer. Um, over time, it helps to with dark spots, things like that. But then they came out with a matching moisturizer so I'm so excited to try these um, I know I'm, I'm on my second one of this serum and then the cream is new Let's see what the texture is like honestly Lancome skincare is pretty great it's definitely higher end but I find it to be very effective Ooh, that cream is soft not too heavy mmm that feels nice Okay, and then this was a, I think they're a Canadian brand that reached out to me. They're from BC. Um, and then this is the, ooh, okay, a body wash, really nice packaging, eucalyptus cocoa natural body wash. Ooh, I love that. I love anything like eucalyptus -y, smells like a spa. And then this is the, it's from Mifa, I believe the brand is. Uh, effective plant-based fragrance-free and non-toxic. This is their all over oil, moisturize, protect, and repair for face, body, and hair. First ingredient is rosehip oil, jojoba oil, baobab oil, bergamot, vitamin E. Okay, cool. I probably wouldn't use this on my face just because like I'm scared of anything like that. <gasps> Ooh, the packaging noise. Definitely use this on my hair or body. Then in here, this is from Lottie London, which is now available at Walmart Canada. I feel like Walmart Canada has started to like carry some new brands lately, which is exciting. So this is their Ready Set Go powder. Then we have dewy setting spray we've got multi-use face brush I think I'll like that for bronzer and then a sponge we'll have to wet it but if you see them they are a new brand to Walmart so this is like this powder has hyaluronic acid in here too which is cool as long as it doesn't leave a white cast it says true translucent we'll see about that and the tough thing about all this too is like take all the time you need da, da, da. And like to some degree sure but also like if anything now more than ever I feel more on my own and I have to support myself for sure I mean I've kind of always felt that way um, so you can't just like you can take a break with, with a job like this but at the same time like there is this opportunity cost factor of like am I losing out on money am I losing out on contracts am I losing out on deals am I becoming irrelevant etc etc and I also love what I do so it's like complicated but luckily I did pre-film a lot of content so you've still seen things going up and I'm trying to film when I do have energy 
Uh, Herbivore sent me out their newest stuff. I love Herbivore packaging, honestly. So this is the Milky Way 10% AHA plus oat soothing exfoliating serum, which I think that's exciting if you're looking for something that has exfoliators in there, but still gonna be more gentle on your skin. And then this is the Herbivore Pink Cloud Soft Moisture Cream. Just the name, but also the packaging. Oh, I was expecting it to look a little more gelish. I don't know why, this makes sense for cloud. Ooh, okay, so it's like a cream, almost to a gel, like it gets really light on the skin. Bimbies, are you having fun? God bless Emily, but she doesn't have the same star power that Rue does, you know? Okay, from Fenty Beauty, what do we got? Oh, Pro Filter Soft Matte Foundation in 310. I feel like I'm 315, but I kind of feel a little pale right now. So it's funny, I was looking for this the other day when I was reviewing the new Fenty Stick Foundation. If you didn't uh, see that review, I'll link it down below. And then this is the Blemish Defeater BHA Spot Targeting Gel. So when you got a pimple, I heard she just gave birth or she gave birth on the, on August 3rd to another little boy. So cute. Kids are gonna be so cool. Okay, also in food related no news, I'm telling you, beauty PR and all that it's so fun so exciting I love it and that's how I know when I'm really depressed is when I like don't want to open my mail but um food food PR I've made it uh so Ben's original sent along their new like 10 medley rices um we've got smoky southwest Caribbean style tomato and herb Chinese five spice as like a person who lives alone I love this kind of microwave rice and stuff. I used to have a rice cooker, no more. Don't have the space for it to just have one, to like cook one thing. Um, and I can get normally like two meals out of this or one big meal, so handy. And then it's kind of fun that it's like already pre-seasoned because then you don't really need to do much to it, just add some veg. I already took some of this out of the packaging to give to a friend. Um, it just had their new eye cream and then a bag that said get ready with me on it, which is cute. And then the facial radiance pads, which are now compostable, which is cool. And these are a classic. Um, they've got glycolic and lactic acid in there, which are both AHAs and they feel like gentle on the skin. I know Jess uses this on her skin and she's more sensitive. It's then from Dermalogica. This is the new stabilizing repair cream. Soothes redness, nourishing lipids, skin barrier, moisture stays in, damage stays out. We love to hear it. Oh, and a big old water bottle. Hell yeah. Every single one of my water bottles is branded. <laughs> from that guy. That's exciting. I love Dermalogica skincare. Oh, and the ooh, 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 two weeks unlimited at other ship, which is a place here in Toronto. If you missed my vlog a while back, I did like an ice bath there and a sauna thing. It's a cool spot. Right. I think I know what this is. If you follow me on TikTok or Instagram, or you've probably seen it here on YouTube as well. My Fenty uh, Mean Money Hustle Baby Highlighter has seen better days. And they finally, oh God, they saw it and were like, can we send you a new one? And I was like, I mean, mine works perfectly fine, but yeah, I guess I'll, I'll take a new one, of course. It's my favorite highlighter probably of all time. I travel with it. I just love the softer highlight side and the, the duo pan. Wow, that is fresh. Mine is held together with painter's tape, so. This is from Ilya. I've liked what I've tried from them. I haven't tried a ton. But this is their new, what is this? Vitamin C and mineral SPF. Join forces in this super powered serum. Three translucent tones minimize white cast with no added coverage. Interesting. So no added coverage. They sent me tone two. But they have a, let's see, okay. Oh yeah, as you blend it out. That's interesting. And it's mineral, SPF 40, vitamin C, niacinamide, and allotoin. Okay, okay, okay. It looks like it's gonna have more coverage than it does, but maybe just really lightly evens out the skin. Definitely feels pretty dewy, but I'm curious. Now let's see what's in here. Keep your gift a surprise. Unwrap your present before opening this envelope. Oh, oh, oh my God, no, no, <laughs> oh my God, 
This is not PR. Oh no. <laughs> I'm so sorry for your loss. Read this short book and remember how special you are to your cat. You gave her the best life and you are her person. Love you so much, Katie. It's really sweet. I think it's called When You Love a Cat. Okay, I wasn't expecting that. I forgot that that was coming. Okay. Next up. <laughs> Next up from Pharmacy. Uh, I've, I've liked what I've tried from Pharmacy. I don't know if I've ever tried their, uh, I'm laughing at myself because I'm just going back and forth between like crying and talking about makeup. <laughs> the Pharmacy Clearly Clean Melt Away Makeup Balm. I know this is like a lot of people's favorite cleansing balm. Then this is the Brighten Up uh, Targeting, targeting dog, dark, spot, dog Spots. Dark Spots. Um, is it like acid, acid PHA toner? Honestly, I'm really thrown off right now. And the Honey Halo Ultra Hydrating Ceramoid Moisturizer, which I've used this before. It's definitely a heavier moisturizer. And they also sent the eye cream, um, but I already gave that away to a friend. <laughs> we can only have so many eye creams, but it looks like a really nice one. Oh my goodness, you guys. Okay, this is a uh, brand that's new to me. I'm not sure if they're a new brand. It's called Base Blue, and they sent me their products, and they're so interesting. So this is the Base Blue Artistic Eyeshadow Palette. I've already opened this up, but look at this. It's like Girl with the Pearl Earring, and that's your palette. Those are the colors. Then they have things like, I thought these lips are so funny. Um, this one is supposed to look like a whale, I think. And then this one maybe an iceberg. It's definitely giving me like indie brand vibes, like very um, unique. And then there's this palette in here, the flower eyeshadow and blush palette, which I think is like really cute, but very usable. It's not like you know the eyeshadow, the other eyeshadow palettes like you almost don't want to use it, but this is like cute and you want to use it. Then they also included some of their like little face colors, which I think you can sort of use for whatever. And they have, they go by different seasons. So this one is autumn, which sounds like my vibe. Um, oh, well, that's really cute. That's what that looks like. So you can kind of use it however, and these are a magnet. I do see them getting kind of dirty because they're almost like cardboardy, but also better for the environment. So very curious to try this brand. I think that the products look really, really interesting. I'm curious about how they perform. Um, but they look pigmented. We'll keep that within its box. <clears throat> and then here, last but not least, the woman of the moment. What's her name? Sophia Ritchie. Everyone's obsessed with her right now. Uh, and then K18, the mask and the oil. I know I really, really love the oil. The mask I've tried, but not enough, like, consecutively to really give you an opinion. So. <laughs> so that's everything. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for taking this emotional journey with me. Um, and let me know how you would like to see these products used in upcoming videos. I definitely have more content to come. But, uh, yeah, life is, life is kicking me in the ass right now. So... I'm doing my best <laughs> therapy on Thursday. Uh, anyways, thank you so much for watching. If you'd like to connect with me, you can find me on Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok at SamanthaJaneYT, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.